stuff a lot of stuff obviously so it's going to take me a long time if i want to start showing you guys one after the other so i'll click quickly show you guys i'll do like a b-roll and show you guys everything but let me show you this one first i was so lucky this was the last one in store so this is the dupe for smeg um so toaster if you know smeg you know that that's what everybody like uses in their kitchen now here and some people also use other toasters but smeg is like the in thing you know for decor but this is even to me it's more pretty than smeg so i got this later i'll get maybe the air fryer to match with it when we move so of course i'll definitely have a longer kitchen island a bigger kitchen space and i'll just decorate them on I can't have for now, I'll keep it here. So first of all, I went to Walmart. I wanted to just get that toaster. And then I realized that, okay, I can get other stuff and just stock up the house because we're running low on some of these things. So I just got it for future purposes. But yeah, and after Walmart, I Target was close by. I can't finish my weekend without entering Target. If I didn't go to that, I would have gone tomorrow. Even if I didn't want to buy anything, I just like to shop in Target. <laughs> so we entered Target and then, the truth is I might even still go to Target tomorrow and I'll show you guys what I got in Target then after that I stopped at the African store and got stuff for of course African food like soup that we might make maybe next weekend or so I was just in the mood to shop anyways let me show you guys things I got Welcome back to another vlog if this is your first time seeing me you're welcome if not you're welcome back again please don't forget to hit the like button subscribe mm -hmm. turn on your post notifications so you don't miss out on my next 
upload today is a work from home day i have an order coming in today that i'll show you guys probably during my break time as well it's something i ordered from zara i also have um the stuff we got from ikea i'll be building that today as well maybe during my break <laughs> my 30 minutes break that is if i don't eat i might eat during work time and then use my break for those stuff or i might just do it after work but i will include that in this vlog as well yes, i got <laughs> i need to take off this jacket it's so cold in my living room i don't even know why it's this cold here my room like my my bedroom is not that cold my living room is very cold I'm currently working and I wanted to show you guys what I received. I received a package from Zara. I ordered a jacket from Zara, a trench coat um, from Zara and I went in store and I did not see my size. They don't have a large in, in store so I had to get um, Renee is home with me today because I'm working from home so she didn't go to daycare. <laughs> So, let me quickly unbox it and hopefully it's what I want. If it's not, then I'll return it. Like, when it comes to Zara, I don't play. If it doesn't give what it's supposed to be given, I'm returning it because you guys know how expensive it is to shop there. So, this is what the trench coat looks like. I've always wanted to own a trench coat like this for a long time. I have a couple of trench coats, but this fabric I don't have. The other trench coat I wear a lot. You guys have seen me wear that a lot on this channel. That one has a different um, texture. So let's see how this one fits. Hopefully, it gives what it's supposed to be giving. So I got this in a size large. This is how, if I have to look at myself in the mirror because you guys are the ones seeing me, I'm not seeing myself. And the lens is not so long, like it's not getting to my um, ankle, but it's almost there and I like it. I don't want it to get to my ankle. I wanted a very long coat that I can just wear over stuff and go to work. It was nice, it looks good. I'll check the mirror and let you guys know what I think. Let me check the mirror. section what you think of the jacket do you like it should i keep it should i return it we're not about to keep what we don't need i actually like it i'm not going to like i think i'm not going to lie i think it's different from the other jackets i have um even if i think i'm not feeling it now but i know with time once i start wearing it i'm going to love it and yeah i bought it because i saw it and i loved it right so I might end up keeping it, but let me know down in the comment section what you think about it. Should I keep it or not? Maybe I might just return it, see if it's actually returnable. Looking at it here, I think I like it. I like the color, I like the style. It's different from the other jacket that I have. Yeah. Hi, it's um three or four hours after I closed from work. So I closed at five, five o'clock. And I went to Zara. You guys remember the jacket I got, I ordered online. I returned it and I took this one. So that one had something here that I did not like. It wasn't, it wasn't sitting well with me. So I just couldn't sleep over it. So I took it back to Zara after I closed from work and I got this one. And I love this one, it's even longer and it just fits better. It doesn't have a lot of 
stuff going on. I also bought something else. I got this uh, suit jacket, or you can call it. A, I love the detail on the hand, see the folded sleeve, and it's a navy blue. I don't have anything in this color, so I got it in XL. Zara sizing, oh my god. I don't even understand them. Like this one I'm wearing is a medium. The one that came earlier was a large. I tried a large of this coat in the store and it was big, huge. It just swallowed me, so I was like, no, let me get a medium. Even with a medium, I feel I can still go smaller, but since it's a coat, I wanted that oversized fit so I can wear it over whatever I'm wearing inside. So that's why I still left it for. Zara size is just very funny. So the large of this one, fit me but the hand was a little bit too tight the medium could not even go anywhere so i had to go with the extra large because i want a very relaxed fit for this one because i want to be able to wear with everything jumpsuits and um, leggings pants whatever okay I, I don't just want to rest restrict it to like suit or fitted wear so i wanted it to be like a casual coat that if i want to run errands i'll just throw it on and anything and wear so that is it for our mini haul so i ordered a couple of stuff online too you guys someone should please hold my credit card because i've been shopping so i ordered some things from um online one suit or coat for, for a different shade i'll show you guys when it comes very beautiful slide 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 back anyway when it comes i'll show you but yeah i love this one more i just wanted to show you guys that i changed that one and i prefer this one and it's beautiful so i'll just take it off and um, shower and rest for the night because i've not done anything this night just finished work and head off to zara because i didn't want that box to sleep in my house i wasn't just comfortable with this this back and everything is the same it's just the front that doesn't have the uh, stuff and I like it like that. Your destination is on the left. to think because i can't remember if i spoke to you guys today but today is sunday we went to church we came back and um yeah i think i remember vlogging in church and i'll just put a little clip before airborne apart from church i also made banga soup i needed to cook for the week so i made banga soup and um what else i think that was it yeah we've eaten oat swallow um i'm about to go out i want to go only 40 minutes drive that nobody sends me but i will go because i enjoy to drive when i'm alone without the kids so they're not going with me i need to put some lip gloss for me yeah i'm going on the 40 i'm going on the 40 minutes drive i want to go get my nails done if i can't um, get my nails done where i'm going to then i'll just get a press on glue because i have a press on near my home i've never done press on before so this is going to be my first time doing press on so i'm going to get my press on in my nails done but if i can't look i didn't book an appointment so if they don't have walk-ins i'll just um get a press on this year i'm panting i'll get a press on i'll just get a glue i heard that if you use the glue that came with the press on the press on will not last but if you get a glue like an adhesive separately the one from kiss or one other brand that i heard about then your press on can last as long as two weeks so i'm going to also check walmart or target excuse me and get a glue that's if i don't make the appointment because i need to make an appointment okay because i realized i've not spoken with you guys today 
I've just been doing bureaus and um, it was a, it was quite an eventful day. It's around 3 19 p.m. So hopefully I should be back before 7 o'clock so I can do my evening reset. So usually in the evening I like to reset two or three hours before bedtime. With that I can sleep early and wake up earlier. Okay. So I, I, I've just tried to have my bath, do my skincare and um, just you know put on a good clean robe, sleep on a fresh neat bed sheet. <laughs> cover myself in a duvet actually now that is cold then watch movies on my laptop or my phone on Netflix or YouTube just something for like one hour or 40 minutes before bedtime then I just drop the phone or the tech, whatever tech I'm using that's how I do my evening reset I don't like to eat at night so I like to eat anything food should stop by 7 or 6 so today I'm not eating again we eat around we just finished eating, which is around 3 or 2 something, and I doubt I'm going to eat anything heavy again. I might just eat something light at night, just snack or fruit. I don't really like fruit, veggies, man, because I have a lot of broccoli from the vlog. Here you can see, so I, I boil it. Sometimes I grill it and add garlic. Um, like you saw in the last video, I had garlic and ginger and a little bit of vegetable oil or olive oil. I put it in the oven and I grill it and it's so delicious. There's some salt and black pepper. So sweet. Um, no sugar sweet but it's delicious. It's savory, it's yummy. So that's it. Um trying to include more food stuff into my vlogs because I enjoy food, although I don't like cooking like before. But I know you guys also enjoy my cooking content. So that's it. I'll talk to you guys once I get back, or if not tomorrow, hopefully. But Take care. I told you guys I'm back. I'm not kidding. I am back. Expect two videos a week, okay? Two videos. So this one just went up today. On Tuesday, I'm going to edit a video and hopefully put it on on um, Tuesday to or Wednesday, then another one on Sunday. So definitely every Sunday there's going to be a video on this channel. 